All right, what's going on y'all? So in today's video, we're going to be using this really fun, I don't know, I guess it's a Soleon Kamo O team. So this team, if you've been following the channel, is a team that we've used already. I also have a haircut if you haven't seen the last couple of videos, so surprise, uh, but we are big chillin'. Uh, I hope everyone had a, a good Thanksgiving and stuff if you are in the Americas or, you know, where we celebrate, I guess, which is the United States. So, yeah, uh, I hope everyone had a good Thanksgiving. Uh, I don't know who else celebrates it, but we're big chillin', so that's the point. <laughs> uh, yeah, the Sylveon Kamo O team, I honestly really like this team, so I just wanted to give it another try. We're technically right now trying to get my alt account into Master Ball tier, so we are playing in my Scarlet version. And so we are a little bit in the low ranks, but honestly, we've been facing some pretty crazy teams in the low ranks, which has been fun, you know? So this is another crazy team, and I think it can perform very well in high ranks and low ranks, hopefully, right? <laughs> so in, in previous testing, we haven't really seen Kamo O getting brought that much i feel like i use it a lot on showdown and then in in the in-game ladder i have trouble finding the correct time to position it that's just i think based on the way i play i like doing damage um setting up is good but you know you need to be able to position it well and while this team can do that you know i find myself trying to get trick room set up more than trying to set up combo right so um, it's kind of like a has to be in the back type of thing and yeah, so etc, right? Um, but I do think this team is really deadly. Uh, Kamo O can definitely do a lot and uh, I think Sylveon to me is the star of the show, right? Like, you know, Sylveon It does need the fire Terra in order to actually be able to deal with iron hands because I originally had Fairy Terra, and then I was just dying to Heavy Slam all the time. Like, And like the fact that they'll actually just commit to the Heavy Slam means Fire Terra is really good. So, you know, you can click Fire Terra. The Specs Hyper Voice does a lot. Specs Hyper v Beam, uh, if you can click, it will definitely Oko something. And, you know, we also have Psy Shock, which is really good into things like freaking Bonnie Noom, I guess. Like, freaking Okie Dogie. And uh, Poison Terra, Galar Moltres, uh, and then the Fire Terra Blast we have for, you know, whatever we need it for, right? So, uh, some good stuff. I mean, Fire Terra Blast is really good for, like, Gold Dango type of things. So, like, you actually do have the ability to hit pretty much everything that you need to be able to hit except for Heatran. And in that case, you have to pressure it to Terra with, like, Otter, Ogre Pond or Landorus, right? So, uh, you can still get away with it, but... Don't, don't mind my controller saying it's dead, it's not dead, it's never dead, okay? That's the secret, it doesn't want to tell you. Um, <laughs> it just says low battery all the time. So anyways, we, yeah, this is a fun team. I hope you guys enjoy watching me use it. I have been thinking maybe Life Orb on Volcarona would have been nice, but I like the Citrus Berry. Um, yay! So we're five and zero with the squad. Okay, so this is the team. Yeah, thank you all for tuning in. Uh, you know, not everyone, you know, no one likes a plug or whatever, right? Like, but uh, yeah, consider giving a like and subscribe. We're, we're as boys, right? Like, we're freaking big chilling here. Uh, yeah, we're, we're close to 900 subscribers. I think that's the point that I was trying to make. <laughs> okay. Um, so this does look like a little bit of Trubus here. Um, there's nothing perfect about this. Nothing per 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 perfect about this. So like I have two options, right? The first option is we start Kroger Pond and Monsieur. 
The second option is we start freaking Landorus and Solion, right? Um, I'm leaning towards this. I want to bring this and then I, I mean this, but like, I just, do I have Imprison? I don't think I do. Do I? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to check next time. Cause like, if I have Imprison, like, what am I doing? <laughs> They do start Cress, Ursula, Luna. They start Sylveon, Ogre Pond. <sighs> we can do this, I believe in us. So young. Nice. <laughs> okay. Tramsh. Absolute tramsh, my guy. Um. So we have to switch in Land or Dringums. No, 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 no. I think I'm gonna lose. Just like, okay, like, <laughs> I guess, I guess we're just gonna not make the right play, like. I can't show this game, like, I, I really can't, like, unless something happens here, like, this is just, like, the worst.
I've freaking misplayed so bad. Like, I cannot believe that. Because the play was never, ever just switch out or Ogre Pond, right? Like, you always want a wood hammer there. But in my mind, I'm like, oh, it's, it's, I'm clicking Sylveon, right? Like, and so I'm trying to switch out Sylveon and I switch out freaking Ogre Pond. Like, that's so dumb. So like literally the only thing I can do here is we start Ogre Pond, we start the giraffe. Um, even if that's the case, they can still technically get around it with Will of Them, right? So I still need to play carefully um, and think hard about what I'm bringing in the back. I like... Landris, kind of. And I like Volcarona. Um. I think Volcarona might be the best. I don't think it's the best, quote unquote. Like, I really like Sylveon here. Um, yeah, I'm just super tilted after that last one, like, shh, I can't believe that. I played so terribly, just because I have, I haven't clicked Hyper Voice in, like, freaking six years, probably, like, you know. <laughs> okay, so, instantly kind of wish that I brought Sylveon. Um, that being said, there's definitely things that we can do, right? Like, we can Terra, we can click Follow Me, we can click Trick Room. Um, yeah, so that I get. Um, the nice thing is that I have Psy Shock, which does physical damage, so my Psy Shock will actually probably just one-shot the uh, Roingant. So we do have Deterra to live the Acrobatics. And they can't use Knock Off, so they're actually just going to do that. And they go for the Will of the Wisp. So I am going to double up the Roaring Moon just in case. I don't think the Roaring Moon... I don't think the other one is putting on enough pressure, right? So I am just like... You know... Like, if I don't get this Oko, I need the extra damage, kind of. And we should still get it even through the burn. Yeah. So I don't think that that would work on certain other Pokemon. They do have that. Um, I just don't feel threatened enough. Like, I really want to just keep pressuring down this slot, right? Um, and it's like... I just feel like, why wouldn't I? Like, you know? Yeah. So, GG's. Um...
<laughs> you know what I mean? Like, what is wheezing gonna do? What is just wheezing on its own gonna do? It can keep clicking Slug Bomb, but I'm gonna keep targeting that other slot vigorously. Like, So, you know, we've got it figured out, kind of, like... Okay. We do need the giraffe. We do, we do need, um... Ogre Pond, we bring this, and then I think in all totality, Volcarona is going to be best, so. So we'll see. Um, yeah, <laughs> just <laughs> that first one. Like it was so terrible. It was the worst thing ever. It was the worst thing in the history of humankind. <laughs> They're really searching. They're saying, "Is he? Is he live?" Or did he run out of time? <laughs> okay. So that's more like something I would have expected. We do still have to click follow me. But if they KO Ogre Pond, that's better for me, so. Ogre Pond is my follow me bot that also does damage. <laughs> So they'll click, you know, Ice School Crash or something. I mean, my guy, like... You know when we get into my, I mean, my guy level of things that it's getting real, you know? When we start saying, I mean, my guy, it's getting real. <laughs> So this is actually why I like Hyper Voice for a graph, right? Like, Hyper Voice for Rig would do plenty. We might not get this KO with Ivy Sudgel, but if we... Okay, yeah, so that's good. Mm -hmm. 
They have to bring out Rillaboom if they want a chance of winning. They do. Yeah. Okay. So, in this case, Rillaboom has to be able to get um, enough damage to KO Ogre Pond before it can do something, right? I think that's very possible. Uh, I really wouldn't hold that against it. Um, we'll get some pretty good damage there. They actually go for that, so that's probably going to lose them the game. Okay. And then they bring out food. Okay, so we got that taken care of. And I believe that if we can just get enough damage on the field right now, um, this is what Landris is good for, actually. Uh, and Landris would be able to clean up this situation pretty convincingly. But I'm just going to do this. Yes, yeah, so I mean, I expect that kind of like. I really want them to KO something here. But, you know, what do you do about that bolt? So, my main plan here is to just get some damage on this right now, and to do that, I will click buttons. They've given me plenty of chances to switch out, so I can't really, like, blame anything for that. Um, let's just go for the wood hammer again. Yeah, because see, like, Throat Spray for a Graph would have just got that KO, right? Um, now that we're at this point, they should be able to get a double KO. And then Trick Room will end, right, which is quote-unquote good for them. I just don't think they can get out of this. Like... So I'm just going to click Fiery Dance, and I'm going to Terra, and I'm just going to lock in the Hyper Voice. Because I just don't think, I don't think they can get out of this. Like, <laughs> like they have to click, they're going to like Moonblast the Sylveon or something, right? Like, I don't really think they'll just click shadow ball like high horsepower like it's possible but Volcarona will move before then so so we are gonna just see um yeah they, they tear it right Go for the grassy glide. 
You go for the moon blast. We'll live this very comfortably. Yeah, so. Fire Terra, Sylveon is clutch. Nice. Okay. See what happens when you press the right button. <laughs> uh. The freaking tragedy, my god. Cause like, I don't know if we would have just shot right back into uh into Ultra Ball tier. but I think we had a pretty good chance. We're gonna have to play another. We're gonna have to play another. <laughs> mm hmm. first one just it just hit me right here you know that's all I'm saying <laughs> uh, okay um so I do think this team is really good against my team we need to be careful I'm thinking this or this as our starts. Um, I'm not 100% sure which I think is going to be best. I feel like this is my safest, if that makes sense. Um, we bring... Volcarona. Well, we need combo, kind of, and then we need, I mean, I just don't really like that that much. Like, I'd be much more comfortable bringing, bringing, um, Landers. So we'll see. You can hear people upstairs, probably. <laughs> So we're just going to start Sylveon and Ogre Pond. This feels moderately similar to the last situation. Except for the fact that I actually like clicking Hyper Voice here a lot. Um, I like clicking Hyper Voice. And... So, I'm really hoping that he goes after my Ogre Palm, but I think I'm going to lose because of the way that I'm playing. Like, if he goes for Trick Room, that's kind of the best I could hope for. 
like go for ogre pond. Ooh, that's not good. That is good because I don't think they can heal enough to live the Terra Blast. Hyper Voice. Yeah, okay, so good. <laughs> I got so stressed out there. So here's one of the bad things about the way that I'm playing, right? Is that... Technically, one of the best things I could do right now would be, I think, to switch into Valk. And then to just go for the... Ivy Sudgel. Okay, so we are kind of throwing. But we do do that. See, this is what Volcarona is good for, man. What do you do? <laughs> um, so I will bring Sylveon back out. We bring Sylveon back out. We go for... I find this situation really annoying because like technically the right play is to get rid of Lunala, right? Or its name isn't Lunala, but you get what I'm saying. Um... Please get flame bodied. <sighs> I need to KO them. This will not KO. Okay, so that's GG's. <laughs> oh my jeeves like <sighs> So Sylveon's a little slow. Right. Can we be honest about that? Sylveon's a little bit slow. 
We might even just go for Iron Head just for the style points here. GG's. <laughs> so we're back in Ultra Ball tier after some grueling matches to some degree. I wouldn't call them necessarily grueling, but like, you know, we just had to Sylveon on them a little bit. Like. So that will get us back to Master Ball or Ultra Ball tier. Um, that's good, you know, that's what you could hope for. We made a big mistake in the first one that cost us the game. Um, and besides that, we did fine. You know, like, it got a little hairy there for a second, but, like, we found our outs, right? And so, yeah. <laughs> it's a good set of matches, and we will see what happens in the next one. But, yeah, thank you for tuning in. Sorry. Uh, we space out, too. <laughs>